Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Asia. If you're new here, today's video is going to be a long-awaited collective haul. I'm super excited about today's video because I just feel like it gives me vacation feels. I'm just so ready for the world to get back to normal and I definitely feel like having this little vacation edit did its job. I'm not going to lie guys, I'm super excited about summer. So if you guys want to see what I picked up and what's new to my collection, just keep on watching. And as always, everything will be linked down below in the description box for you to shop. But before we even get right into the video, I do want to say thank you to ShopTagger for sponsoring this week's video for us. If you guys don't know what shop tagger is it's a google chrome extension in the app it just does all the hard work of shopping for you guys so i have a link to shop tagger down below but the reason i love shop tagger is it's because it helped me get a brand new pair in season designer shoe for less than retail I can't make this type of stuff up. So ShopTagger is super user friendly. Once you download the Google Chrome extension or even the app on your phone, you're just able to sign up to be notified if something comes back in stock that's out of stock, if it has a price drop, or even find a relevant coupon code to your order. So you're saving money some way, somehow. Um, I personally love ShopTagger just because you can create wish lists, which means for me, I have less screenshots in my phone. I can manifest these items directly into my life. And like I said, you can sign up to be notified via email or even text message because not everybody's an email person or notify you pertaining to what you need a notification for so for me i've been waiting on something to come back in stock from dior i'm not gonna tell you guys what it is because i don't need you to talk me out of it but it has definitely come in use for those types of things for me the best part about it is if you're using shop tagger on your computer it will find a coupon code just for you for your order it scours the entire internet for a relevant coupon code which i feel like is really really great because there's nothing worse than making a purchase especially if it's expensive and you could have got 10 percent off 15 percent off x y and z but lastly shop tagger does offer cash back at select retailers yes i know they are just on it okay guys when i was on there last night scrolling and everything looking for new items to add to my wish list all my favorite retailers <laughs> qualify for cash back i was like <laughs> where have i been why did no one tell me about this? So it definitely has been coming in use for me for preparation of my birthday coming up. Again, Shop Tagger is literally just here to help you save money. I love that for us because if you watch me, that means that you like shopping just as much as me. But yeah, I'll have a link to Shop Tagger down below in the description box to so make sure you check them out. And without further ado, let's just get right into the video. So I have a lot, a lot of stuff. I don't even want to show you guys. I'm going to show you guys. Let, let me get this. Uh, <laughs> this whole basket is filled with things. I, I don't make the rules. I just live by them. I'm trying to tell y'all. Before we even get into today's video, I'm going to just discuss everything I have on just because somebody's going to ask and it's going to be the somebody that doesn't read the description box and girl, read the description box she is your friend okay just starting right off my rings are from amazon i will have my amazon store a link down below for you guys and they are like in the jewelry or the fashion section or something like that my watch is a rolex you guys always ask but yeah she's so pretty right <laughs> so cute uh, my two bracelets are from Zara they came in a pack we'll discuss that in the haul as well my sweatshirt is fire do you guys see what it says it says black woman deserve a luxury period I will have everything linked down below for you guys for that and yeah let's just get right into it because girl it's just so much stuff I just my anxiety is getting a little bad so I got something from Goyard obviously it's a tote what color do you guys think I got because I feel like you guys are gonna be like, who, who is she? <laughs> Whoa, Asia, blink twice if you need help. So I got a tote and I got a yellow Goyard. Oh my, whoa, oh my God. She is so, so stinking pretty. I just got her because I just thought it would look nice against my skin color. You know, a little tan, a little bronzy moment. You guys know I wear neutrals, white, grays, and stuff a lot. So I just thought this would be so cute. I think she's adorable. I got the GM for travel purposes because this I plan on this being my travel bag. Um, I don't really use like my Neverfull for anything besides traveling either. So yeah, I mean, I don't carry this much stuff these days and I try not to. So I can't imagine me using this like on a day-to-day -day basis, but I think she would be very cute sitting on top of my suitcase. So that's why I got her. And she's just a regular canvas tote bag. And then she has a little pouch in the inside. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna tell you guys the price just in case you guys were curious because 
Goyer is just very confusing because you can't buy it online. So unless you have an essay that has it in their store, because not all department stores have Goyer, or you're in New York or Miami or Paris and all that type of stuff, you kind of are just oblivious about it. So like I said, I have the GM and mine's was a thousand eight hundred and seventy dollars with a tax of one hundred and twelve. So my total was one thousand nine hundred and eighty two dollars. So next up we have something from Alexander Wang um, yeah these are called the Julie sandals yeah Julie logo letters black um, I got these in a size 37 you guys know that's my like true standard shoe size so I found these shoes and I got them I was just like it's better for me to just you know see how I feel about them than to miss out on them these are what these look like so they're just a regular black sandal um, I have a lot of black sandals I'm not gonna lie to you guys but I don't have like a standard staple one I'm lying I got the time for it once I forgot. <laughs> um, but yeah, these are just like a standard staple spaghetti strap. So it's just a strap across. I love the toe square. Toe squares are so in this year. Um, and they also come back in style every few years because this was like, you know, a 90s girl thing. I like the material. The material is almost like a, not like an athletic material, but like a scuba-y material, which I feel like it looks really... I don't know like athleisure you, you know that's my thing so really like that um the heel is nice and skinny and cute so this is what both shoes look like but the reason these are so bomb is because once you turn them to the side girl they have um a crystallized wang on this shoe so this is the left foot and then on the right shoe it has a crystallized a so from the side it's a wang you know the vibes you guys know me i just love me a baby gaudy moment a little subtle flex if i do but yeah so i picked these up because i needed a new pair of this style of shoe in my life um especially for summer because i do get my use out of them so yeah we're just gonna hop right in but it is definitely something that girl I get my use out of them like i really really do but what i picked up was a pool slide and i just love a pool slide like i said my style is very athleisure and chill the girl wears these with socks with no shame i think it's swaggy like a white top, a white tall sock not like an ankle sock um but i love how they're like black on black it's so freaking chic looking again gaudy because i could have just got a regular black pair of sandals but they kind of say balenciaga but these are basically going to replace my Givenchy ones um i've had multiple pairs of the Givenchy ones i love them they're really pretty they just get really messed up in my opinion for the money like the logo and stuff wears off so i picked these up in a 38 because like i said i do like to wear them with socks and stuff so just to give myself a little extra room but yeah love me a pool slide they also come in nude with the black letters as well and i really want them but when I went to order them, they said they threw it up for pre-order and they won't ship till May 29th. What? How? Where? And why? So moving on to clothing, I have so much good stuff. Like I really, really do. It makes me so excited. It just gives me the fills in this basket. So we're going to start off with Zara. So the first thing I got from Zara is this little knit set. Everything is on hangers already because this is my second time filming this video. But it's whatever. We move. So it's like the knit. I'm going to call it a diaper because it looks like a diaper to me. But it's like a knit little boy short. Um, I feel like it may not be the most flattering on most body types. Like unless you got a real bomb arch in your back. Um, but these give me yacht vibes you guys know i am always shopping for my yacht excursions because that is just what i do in this summer honey and i just think this would be so cute with like this type of jewelry and a nice little hat on you know for those moments you don't want to wear a bikini because why so yeah and it is just so good i love the texture of it and how it looks so it's like in this really nice still gray with like an undertone of blue and then it comes with this little bralette super super cute it looks like it has an underwire but it doesn't it's just the way that it's sewn so yeah this was super super cute everything is a size medium by the way that you're gonna see medium or medium to large because you know your girl got a baby bump now i don't even know if this fits with the belly okay but that's okay because i may have half my summer back so <laughs> They could get born eventually. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's okay. But this was super, super cute. So I just got it. I just it's certain things like this you don't want to miss out on Azara because you'll be like, I don't need it, and then you want it, and then it's gone. So 
Let's get it. So the next thing that I got was this cream set from Zara. It's from the Limitless Contour Collection. And you guys know that collection is my jam. I would buy it all if it all fit my vibe. Um, I just love, love, love the quality. Again, because I am like very athleisure style, but I like to be able to dress things up. This like stretchy rib just does it for me and it holds up really, really well in the wash because as I always say, I don't take care of my clothes. I do wash everything and dry it, girl. I don't care. So it's like in this really nice like buttery cream. Um, not a color that I would normally go for, but I think it would be really, really nice with gold jewelry in a time. So it's just a standard racer bag. You guys know I have these in every color that they've ever come in. But this one this year, it has like this nice sweater reverse seam material at the bottom which i just thought was really really nice and i got the matching tights because now that i am pregnant i just need comfortable clothes that are not going to suffocate me um so i plan on wearing this with like an oversized button up or like an oversized blazer or something just to cover me up but that way i could just be very comfortable because it's super super stretchy um so yeah it's just good for the bump because i'm a swaggy mom i don't i don't have time to shop in the maternity section okay i'm gonna wear regular clothes <laughs> And that's just gonna be it. So the next little set that you guys probably saw just hanging in the thing, it's this little pink thing. I know the bra is a little a little revealing, especially because my boobs is getting kind of big because they produce in milk, but it's so sporty and cute. It's like a super, super revealing bra. Like unless you're about that life, don't get it. Or unless you don't have like boobs, <laughs> you'll be okay. But I love the pink. I've been so into color lately. It's kind of ridiculous. And I got the little matching shorts oh my goodness so cute i'll probably end up wearing this around the house because i don't that where am i wearing this to outside right now while i'm pregnant but i thought this would be so cute with like a hot pink linen blazer and just a whole bunch of jewelry just like very jacquemus how the hell do you say that brand i think we should learn that but i probably won't it probably won't stick because it's just it's just one of those things i guess i can't so yeah just make the whole thing a monochromatic pink look like i think with like some really big pink pretty earrings would be bomb mm. and just a really nice sandal like giving the girls a vacay vibes okay with a nice wooden bag yeah love it if the belly wasn't there i would be wearing this and look at the color on my skin girl <laughs> yes love it can't wait to wear it so so cute again this is from the limitless contour collection but this is going to be such a vibe with a matching blazer or it will also look nice with like a white oversized button up like if you have one that'd be cute too mm -hmm. yes it would serving looks for the girls okay all right so the next thing i picked up from zara is this little white bralette for no particular reason other than it's just a nice and basic because i feel like my maternity wardrobe is basically going to consist of me wearing comfortable bottoms like tights and leggings and biker shorts um and then like oversized blazers and stuff just to kind of feel like covered so yeah i got this because again i just love bralettes i really really do this is a medium it was only 20 dollars. it doesn't have like a lot of support in it but you guys know i have like a smaller full boob so i don't need push-up support um but it is see-through so my nipples in my areolas might show um but yeah super super cute it's like it's just in a really nice pretty summery knit like it just gives you summer because of the material even though i probably have a thousand of these this one is different she deserves her own mention okay all right so next up i have two things from jlux label they're basically the same thing it's just once for me once for harp so i picked this up these matching like coffee toffee colored sweatpants they're like in this really cute waffle material um they did come with matching hoodies and stuff i didn't pick up the hoodies because i just felt like i didn't want to be drowning in waffle material but I thought this would look really nice if we carried our matching Prada bags, girl. Because I don't know if you could see mine and hers. Yeah, we don't get around to wearing those. <gasps> oh, I thought the seam was messed up. But that's just an extra string, girl. I was going to call JLo Sable and have a word for them, okay? But yeah, Harper tried hers on yesterday. And she's like, wants to wear them so bad. Um, but they're super, super cute. They're really nice quality as always. JLo always has amazing quality. Um, and they're, you know, like double line. And the waistband is really thick on both of them. So I just think these would look really cute with like a white t-shirt on both of us. Um, probably me a bodysuit. And then, but like I said, the Prada bags and then gold jewelry. I think that's it. That's pretty much the vibe I'm going for. But yeah, sometimes when I do stumble across mommy and me things that are plain like this, I could tolerate it. All the other brands that do it, I cannot tolerate it. <laughs> so the next thing is stuff from Shein. Um, I just picked this from Swimwear because I do like the Swimwear from them. And because I'm very finicky, like I go through phases with Swimwear. 
I like to just throw in like some really affordable swimwear that I can kind of just mix and match rather than to commit to because I'm going to show y'all a very expensive bikini in a little bit. But the first one I got is this really, really cute paisley. I know what you're thinking, girl, Asia. Blink twice if you need help because where's our good sis at? Our good sis don't wear color. Why is this tangled? I don't know. Yes, me, colored paisley like what the hell but it was so cute i just couldn't resist it i don't know ever since i've been pregnant i just been really into color and because i was like really really sick in the beginning and only wearing like big sweatsuits i'm just ready to wear color and form-fitting stuff like i'm so excited to be pregnant in the summertime because with harper i was pregnant all through winter and i had her early spring so i didn't have a i didn't have a fire pregnancy wardrobe you know oh this time baby we're gonna be serving the looks okay um but yeah it's just so cute i love how the top is like super detailed um it has pads in there but yeah super super cute no particular reason that i needed this i just thought this was adorable you know sometimes you just like add to cart it's only six dollars add to cart right yeah that's me and then it just has a matching bottom that has like little ring details um i don't know how i feel about that when it's time to tan because you guys know i love tanning but she's cute though she's super cute because that's the type of bikini you need the whole bikini just not one piece um and the next one i got is this one shoulder bikini and like this really nice ribbed mauve i just thought this would look really pretty on my skin color yeah i like this color again i'm just trying to wear color these days because why not my life is my life is going great i just want to wear color so the one shoulder is just a vibe because i just feel like it's just very classy very understated so you know that's my vibe and it has the matching bottom and these are really nice quality because they're like that nice double line um with no seams which are like some of my favorite bikinis they're super flattering but like they're really stretchy as you can see and for my bikini some she in i do get a medium but the next bikini i picked up is this one this color is so so pretty it's like in this really like cool tone blue i don't know i'm not a blue person also not a pink person but <laughs> that was cool what's going on um but this one is a revert like the other side on the one shoulder so clearly my tan line is gonna be messed up but whatever um super super cute though this one is a smooth smooth material so it's not ripped like the other one but i just thought this was really really nice again it's a color but it's more of like a muted one so i feel like it'll be okay and the matching bikini bottom again quality is really really nice well she and you just have to be careful and read the reviews that's all it takes girl People think it's a sport. Just read the reviews. Just read their reviews. Bikini set that I got from that is just a standard white bikini. Um, I love having standard white and black bikinis. I'm gonna show you both. Just because you could wear them all the time. They're just so classy. Oh my goodness. They just give you the fills with gold jewelry and like monochromatic pieces like shirts and stuff like that. So yeah, it's just a standard string triangle bikini. It's literally nothing fancy about it. And then I also picked one up in black, even though I have one in black. Actually, I one in white too, but whatever. She in gets you because you would just be like, $5 this, $6 this, $7 that. Oh, okay. Like $10 is probably the most you're going to spend on something on the site. Next thing you know, you have a lot of stuff in your cart. So yeah, I just picked up a black one as well. I picked up this additional top because I've been loving this style of bikini top. Like I really, really have. And it basically is one that it has like the peekaboo hole in the middle and you could like crisscross across the chest or just go straight up the halter neck. So I've been really digging this style. So yeah, I picked up this in white too because girl, I'm just trying to be like the most elevated bougie version of myself this year, you know? 25, that's intense girl, that's very intense. All right, so the next bikini is from a brand from Australia. Oh my God, I'm, getting, I'm showing you guys it. So this one is from a company called, I don't know if it's Biddy or Bidey. Um, I'm, I'm gonna take a wild guess that it's Bidey. Biddy sounds kind of weird, but like I said, it's from Australia. I got this in a medium, because like I always tell y'all, I'm a big body bends, especially now that I'm growing a human. Um, it's just so freaking pretty guys the quality is amazing obviously for what you pay for right again it's one of those tops love it i oh, can't wait to wear this this is just this is just giving me the feels y'all it really is with my mom boobs don't play with her don't play with her okay the colors just oh the colors are just something i don't know it just and like this even the string in the inside it's like a glittery string like it's not a typical side lid so so beautiful and then it has a matching tie string bikini this 
the bikini bottoms come in like different things you know like different brazilian cuts and stuff depending on what you like as a person i just love me a good tie string it's most flaring on my body my little hip dips or whatever because i am a natural body you know and i just got the matching hair tie because why not i was already on the site at that point just give the whole thing to me you know just give it all to me all right so we're just gonna go into pretty little thing now um you guys know i haven't been on pretty little things website since like, my last sponsorship with them and no particular reason other than i just was tired of clothes but now that i have a baby I need clothes. I'm gonna mention two items that I don't have in front of me just because they are in my drawer. Um, but they are the maternity biker shorts from Pretty Little Thing. And if you are pregnant, definitely pick them up. I'll still link them down below for you guys. Uh, the quality was amazing. It was like in the thickest rib material and it covers the entire belly, which was really nice. Like I know I could get a lot of support out of them. Um, so yeah, I got them in the black and the tan. They're just in my drawer already because I didn't think it was gonna be getting warm. <laughs> so quick but now it's like 70 degrees outside but yeah those are definitely really great because i saw a lot of you in the comments saying y'all was pregnant too so girl i got you i got you right, so the first thing that i got from pretty little thing is this chocolate sweatshirt it says wyoming and tan i don't know i just thought this was really really cute i got this in a large you guys saw me wearing this in the vlogs recently um chocolate sweatshirts is just not something that's really in my collection so yeah, i just picked this up i got a large so that it was super bulky on me even though i am grown a human for the 1000th time um but i like how it's like basically monochromatic like it's not a bright color on the text and i don't know i'm gonna go to wyoming don't you guys want to go to wyoming so yeah this is super super cute i love the sweatshirts and pretty little thing i've never been disappointed with their pullovers like ever in my life <laughs> so the next thing i got oh i cannot wait to wear this guys especially with my belly this is a beach dress it is kind of sheer I would wear it outside because it's so cute just with like a nice black bandeau underneath for some pasties and like a high-waisted brief or something but it's so so cute i've always wanted this in pretty little thing it's always sold out every single summer so get it now before the girls catch on okay so it's like in this really pretty linen i don't know if you guys can see that it is a little bit see-through and it's just a standard dress right but then you turn around and girl the whole back is out a vibe okay so the next two dresses that i picked up they're actually the same exact dress i couldn't pick a color <laughs> listen but i know these are going to be amazing for one postpartum two while i'm pregnant like all of that fun stuff but also just day to day like you know like when i'm not pregnant because they're such good quality and they're super like fashion forward they're, like a little different um so they're basically just like these sweater dresses it's like in this really pretty rib material it's super super soft and comfortable it has a whole bunch of buttons it goes all the way down to the floor i just think this will look really nice like a little bit of chest showing a little bit of leg showing and like a really nice sneaker my prada boots or a heel even so yeah i got it in white and black because i oh it's not the front because i just couldn't decide they also have it in gray um i didn't think i needed it in gray that's why i didn't get it even though at first i did have the gray one in my cart but you could also wear it open which is what i really like as well so to over a bikini with some denim shorts and a tank top some jeans like whatever like just a nice little sweater throw um so yeah these are really really nice the next thing you guys have been hearing me basically talk about this whole entire haul for bikinis and it is this white linen button up y'all she is so so pretty she's literally like the most perfect loose lightweight linen um i got this in a us 10 because i just wanted her to be oversized i just wanted her to hang really effortless on my body and she is so so pretty so happy i got this um it's really really nice i think it is a little on the higher end for pretty little things for like price wise but you could definitely tell like when you receive it but i like how it's like a little share like a linen because it just looks more beachy more breezy more effortless more cover girl maybe it's maybelline but yeah really really love this and when i did try this on with the bikinis girl y'all not ready for me on instagram this summer y'all not ready for me to go on vacation soon because girl this is the vibes, okay? All right, so the next group of stuff is from Misguided. Again, I haven't shopped in Misguided in a while because I was being sponsored so much. Um, and then once I stopped taking sponsorships because I was trying to hide my pregnancy, I just stopped looking for clothes and now I need them because I don't fit none of my stuff. So basically, um, when you're pregnant, you really are limited to wearing stretchy dresses. Um, nothing else you could really wear so i don't mind that though because i feel like the bump is something you should embrace and it's something that a lot of people feel their sexiest during so yeah i picked up this gray midi dress it's like in this nice little rib material it has more of a sporty feel because it has a collar to it but i just thought this would be super cute 
with like a hoodie thrown over my shoulders or a pullover sweatshirt um like over my shoulders y'all not on but over my shoulders and like with some socks and some sneakers or something or just some like nice little sporty air forces trainers whatever just to run errands in and because it is a midi dress it'll just fit really nice and taut on the bump so the next dress that i got from misguided though is this chartreuse color and girl do you see this color she is beautiful this chartreuse is really really beautiful as you can see it just is it's just pulling from my skin tone which i really really like and i really like how these stripes are like a different shade of the chartreuse color than the background color so so cute i cannot wait to wear this i love how it has a collar i love how it buttons all the way up and down so again it's just something you kind of just play with until you find out what works for you um but yeah love love this it's just i just feel like this is romantic you with like a, a lace white bra mm. wow or like a nude one mm. chef's kiss mm. i do it every time in my head every single time so the next thing I got from Misguided is this dress style that has been everywhere. I've seen it done by so many different companies, but I didn't want one that was like super thick bandage material that I figured like the higher end companies would be, but I didn't want something that was like super, super cheap and flimsy. So I knew like Misguided was kind of the middle ground for that. Um, so it is a really nice knit material, like not too heavy, not too thin. And it has like this really pretty, I want to say like print sweetheart neckline, scallopy like style brood part and then it has the square neckline you guys know i really like square necklines they don't put them on a lot of clothing items but i do like them they're super figure flattering and it's just a midi dress all the way down um it's probably actually goes to the ankles i just thought this would be super super nice if i ever needed to go to dinner or just like a nice night out on the town and just dress up a little bit but not do too much so yeah i just thought this would be super pretty i feel like this will also be pretty if you have like dinner rehearsals coming up if you're married um, or like an engagement thing now that the world is kind of getting back to normal or even just taking like some engagement photos i feel like this would be a really pretty dress you guys just know i just love knits so yeah this was the last thing that i picked up from misguided and i just like white dresses i just feel like they're so pretty <laughs> so the next two things out of our basket haul is from source unknown these are the first things i've ever bought from source unknown i really like the whole vibe of source unknown um but because i'm pregnant i didn't want to order too much stuff obviously and then also because i don't own anything from there i kind of didn't know what the quality was hitting for like i could tell the quality was good especially from the prices but you just don't know like sometimes everything could be good quality but doesn't mean it's for you you know like i'm very finicky about stuff like that so i got these like as my starter items into the brand um if you do say so but both of these tank tops were 45 dollars each they're the exact same tank top i literally just couldn't choose a color but they're really really pretty they're probably not gonna be able to like really wear them while i'm pregnant um but they're super cute they're just like a nice tank top it's like almost in a terry cloth material um and it has like a raw edge but i just like the top because like I just feel like the knots are just super pretty. Um, it's just something that makes it a little bit different than a regular tank top. All right, and now we're moving on to ASOS, y'all. I'm not really an ASOS person, I'm not gonna lie. I do go on ASOS a lot just because I feel like if you are persistent with ASOS, you can find some really good things, some really different pieces, especially for vacation. But there's just so much stuff that I just get so overwhelmed. <laughs> so yeah, it's not somewhere I shop from often, um, but they do always have good things. So this time I actually did find stuff and I actually really liked it. I only had to return like three items in my order. I feel like that's a very, very good, okay? So the first thing I got was this black linen cover-up. Again, you don't have to wear it only with bathing suits, but I just love these things. This is also like a really nice heavy-duty linen. When you look at it, it is see-through, which I like, but it's like a, it's almost like a plaid. Like, I don't know, the stitching on it is really nice. And it's just super, super pretty. I got this in a size eight. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know why I was jumping between eights and tens. The lighting is going in and out because this is black. But yeah, this is so, so nice. When I tried this on with a white bikini and a black bikini, girl, it just Turks and Caicos me. All right, so the next two things I got are bikinis. Why I didn't, I didn't realize it at the time. Uh, I kind of went bikini crazy, but I just feel like that's pretty much only you could wear when you're pregnant because <laughs> what else are you supposed to fit in so the first one that i picked up is like this really really cute um lavender and yellow 
know it looks really weird because when i got it in the mail i was like i'm not gonna like this but when i tried it on it actually is so adorable like it literally is the cutest thing it has the straps to go over the arm not a halter neck or anything super super cute it's literally the cutest thing i've ever seen on i also was a little skeptical about the bikini bottoms because they gave me like tarzan vibes like i didn't know why they were so long um but again it was something really really cute on i got this in a us6 so my regular standard size and as you can see like the front of the bikini and the top is like a scrunchy ruche material but the back of the bikini is normal um but it's just something really cute and playful for a vacation you know just to be like a little less serious because i feel like i'm just at that phase in my life i just want to have a good time i'm not here for a long time you know the next bikini i got is this oh this cobalt blue i love cobalt blue i really really do it gives me 80 vibes because it's like in this crunchy reflective material or like even like american apparel vibes you guys remember that store how old are you um, but it's just a standard triangle bikini. I wish it had like bigger booby parts, but it's okay. Or like pads in it, but I actually don't like pads in my thing. I just like the option <laughs> that you gave them to me. Just a standard bra, and then it's just a standard tie bikini bottom. But again, it was the color for, look at this color, y'all. You see this color against the skin? Stop it. But yeah, I just thought this would be so cute as a pop of color in the summertime. Um, it's really nice quality as well. So super excited about this bikini too. And the last thing that I got from ASOS is a pair of shoes. You guys don't really see me talk about more affordable shoes. Um, it's mainly because I don't find them often that they are up to par for, for me quality wise. And that's more so because I have so many designer shoes that I feel like I'm a little spoiled about quality and craftsmanship and stuff. But I picked these up. These are basically a dupe of the Fenty ones. I like the Fenty ones. Um, I just didn't like them enough to actually pay the fancy price tag <laughs> no shade to riri but it's not my type of shoe so i didn't want to invest in it if that makes sense um, so i got these in pink from asos they have them in multiple colors um guys these are really really great quality i actually was very shocked i don't own any shoes from asos um and this is like the actual asos collection and these are heavy like they do not feel cheap at all and at the size like there's really nice quality it has like a gold thing under here um like they definitely paid attention to detail even though they copied another brand but who am i i, I ain't the one that gotta sue them so i'm gonna just get in while they got them um because again it's not something that i would have paid the 700 dollars, or i think they might even have been eight but i do like the shoe you know so i really like this pink imagine this shoe with this blue bikini on with the white uh what is it called the white shirt on top i know you're fucking lying i know you're lying don't say i ain't give y'all a look so so cute not a pink person but this fuchsia magenta hot pink is so pretty and it looks really nice on the foot it's not tight at all like it definitely is a little bit on the wider side um and it just has the tie so yeah i i honestly was so blown away by these that i did go to see what other colors they have because i want them just to have as a nice summer shoe um and yeah they have like some cushion right here so highly recommend these i really really do i'll link all the colors down below for you guys just in case you're not looking for a pink shoe but you still like the shoe i got you girl all right guys so that was everything that i got for the month of march i know we were here for a while so i hope you guys enjoyed let me know if you picked up anything down below and let me know if you guys use shop tagger to do so like i said in the beginning of the video thank you so much to shop tagger for partnering with us for this week's video everything will be linked down below in the description box as always i just felt like i had to treat myself a little bit extra this month because my birthday is coming up and i don't know if you guys remember but i bought myself a birthday dress a few months ago Clearly, I won't be wearing it because my birthday is not going as planned. Yeah, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching as always. And I will see you guys in my next video.